Well, there's, there's kind of two things I always wanted to, to do when I was a kid. Is, is one, be a farmer, and two, be a pilot. And uh, fortunately, I've actually kind of achieved both. Our farm is centered around our horses. We, we truly love all of our horses, and our, our strategic plan is to take care of them as the best that we can, and we enjoy that. That is a, a true labor of love. Our whole life pretty much revolves around our horses now. Since we, I don't have generations of farming experience, I approach my, my purchases and operation just like I do my aviation. I, I show up well prepared and, and, I, and I try to do most of my work on the ground. And before I step into the tractor, I pretty much have an idea what I want to do. There's not a cookie cutter approach or a cookbook approach. I don't have that. But the, the most important thing is going with an open mind. Be able to accept other people's opinions. Accept criticism, accept uh, information and, and, and other ways to do things. And do your research. There's so much available now in books, and you start reading, and you watch videos, and you ask local farmers, hey, how do you do this? And now with, with the multimedia that you have on the computer, you can almost figure out how to do anything, and then mold that to fit your needs, and then you apply the economics and how much you can afford to get at any particular time. And when you buy, plan ahead. Don't get exactly what you need now because you're going to wind up replacing it. Try to get one that's one step more advanced or one step more productive and then it'll, it'll probably save you in the long run because the, the incremental costs are insignificant. And pick a dealer you can do with. All the equipment is, is good, but you need to find a dealer that you like to deal with. So I go to Doug and, and Varnberg Implement. I got to know them and and, uh, and I, I appreciate they, they talk to you, they'll give you advice, they're always there for parts and service. And in terms of the, uh, the Heston Massey Ferguson name, very reliable, they're worldwide, and I can't say nothing bad about them.